you circled the entire planet on a zip line? <laughs> All right, this structure would require continuous structural integrity through variable gravity gradients, atmosphere, and orbital velocity changes. Kind of like the space elevator concept, which actually has similar material feasibility challenges that are discussed when designing tethers for theoretical nuclear-powered orbital launch systems. How long would it take you to zip all the way around? Well, at 40 miles an hour, you would be riding for 623 hours. That checks out. Big problem is fighting air drag. Not catastrophic, but far beyond human endurance. That's about 26 straight days of hanging in a harness. Yeah, even if this was a person with unlimited endurance, the harness straps would experience constant load cycling and fatigue. Not good. Now, if you went 100 miles per hour, it would only take you 10 days, but- That's well over 100 pounds of air drag you're gonna be fighting the whole time. At that speed, the constant wind would dry out your eyes and make your lips crack and bleed. Airflow is punishing. Since the sun would be shining on your face for 10 days, your skin would soon blister and- You'd still have day and night cycles. Peel off. That wouldn't happen, though, if this were an orbital zip line, solar radiation, including UV and ionizing, would be severe and you're gonna want spacecraft-grade radiation shielding.